Hey guys, Scott here with Ajax Motorsports. I'm continuing our series on gear selection and what gear you should get. You know, goggles are a little bit of an outlier because the best goggle may not be what fits best. You know, maybe a mid-level goggle or an entry-level goggle, as far as price point goes, might be the better goggle for you. And that's really gonna depend on how it fits. And so when you're selecting goggles, I really recommend that you bring your helmet in or uh, if we sell that same model helmet, just come on in, try it on, and then try some goggles on with that. If you already know what goggle fits you really well and you want to continue that, well, that's easy. You just find the new goggle colorway that you like. But as far as goggles goes, I would say there's good, there's better, there's best. And that's really going to be referring a lot to on uh, the makeup of them, your goggle lens material, and uh, the fit technology that's in there as well. But a lot of it has to do with the foam that's in there too. So some of your higher end, mid-level goggles as well are going to have multiple densities and, and styles of foam in there that's going to help it to uh, make a, basically a gasket to your face, keeps the dust out, and it's also going to keep the sweat out of your eyes. Starting out here, we have the Oakley O-Frame. This is going to be a $50 goggle. I would say an entry-level goggle is going to range anywhere between $35 to maybe $55, $60, right? Uh, what you're going to get out of those entry-level goggles, typically a little bit smaller frame. Um, typically just maybe a little bit older technology. So maybe a goggle that was leading tech 15 years ago, that's going to be more your entry level goggle now. Uh, and then kind of goes up from there. So typically they're going to come with just one lens, no extras. This particular one does have a nose piece that's removable. And if this particular goggle is what fits you the best, don't shy away from it. 100% has a few different options in that price point as well. And I know a lot of pros that, uh, you know, you know, money's not an object. You know, they can get whatever they want, and they're still going to go for maybe an Acuri, which is a mid-level goggle. Um, so don't necessarily let price reflect what's best for you, it's particularly in goggles. For our mid-level option, we're going to have our Scott Furies. It's about a $70 goggle. And what we're going to see here is a little bit bigger frame. We have a little bit nicer foam padding inside of here, better for the sweat resistance, a little more comfortable as wear as well. May not get the chafing out of that. Uh, it's a good breathable goggle. Uh, it's going to have tear off posts on this one as well. Um, this is kind of their step down from their Scott Prospect, which I would consider it would be their high end goggle. So it actually has pretty much the same frame on it. It just has a different, uh, it doesn't have the outriggers on it. It has uh, just more of a traditional where the strap goes straight to the frame. Still a good goggle. You see if it fits uh, your face and fits your budget. Going over to our high end goggles. So Oakley right here, this is the uh, air brake. Also, and this would be like your 100% has your Armegas. And then, as I mentioned, your Scott Prospects would fit in this category as well. And so a few things on here that are unique to more of your higher end goggles is going to be your outrigger here. And so the outrigger, basically um, your strap goes to it instead of back to the goggle frame over here. And so that disperses pressure to the different area of the goggle, which pushes it onto your face a little bit better without having just tighter spots, maybe particularly on your nose or on the side of your cheeks, so you get a better seal and better fit. Um, also with your higher end goggles on that elite level goggle right here, you're also gonna be getting um, usually better lenses that uh, don't distort the image. Uh, sometimes they even like this particular one's a prism lens, um, which is just their version of something that just really boosts the light and the, the contrast. So it helps you to pick up on the, the ruts and the, the different contrast in the soils. Um, so most of your elite level goggles are gonna be over hundred bucks. Some of your Oakleys are even over 200 bucks. Um, but ultimately it's gonna matter as far as to what is gonna fit your head and what's gonna fit your helmet and what's gonna fit your budget. So keep that in mind. We stock a ton of different goggles. We've got them all on display. So bring your helmet in, try one of ours on, and then try a bunch of different goggles on, see what fits you, see what fits your price point. But uh, yeah, this was a short little video on goggles and we hope to see you soon.